This video will show you how to mount Floop 3561 FC vibration sensor on blowers and other single shaft machines. Measuring vibration with a wireless sensor is very much the same as with the portable meter. Vibration from the rotating shaft and components on the shaft transmit to both bearings, then into the housings, and then into the sensors. Use the instructions in this video for a single motor shaft with two bearings and something on the end of the shaft such as a pump, a blower, a fan, or other machine types, including compressors. When mounting the sensor on the machine bearings, think about what is on the inside and how vibration will transfer to the sensor on the outside. Here are some do's and don'ts for the sensor placement. Do mount the sensors on the motor bearings. Don't mount on the fan or pump since there aren't bearings there. This includes a fan housing and pump casing. Do mount the sensor on the top or the side or the end. Don't mount the sensor in the middle of the motor, only on the bearings. Do mount the sensor on the solid metal. Don't mount sensor on soft or thin metal like the cooling fan cover or the motor fins. Do mount one sensor per bearing in most cases. Remember, vibration transmits 30 to 36 inches. On small machines, one sensor on the motor drive end would see vibration from the other bearings as well as the pump impeller or fan blades. Don't forget to use an additional sensor for bearings that are farther apart. Visit fluke.com slash quickstart for more setup videos.